Hey guys, it's Kevin here with Shadow Dealers, and this time we're going to be going with cards. Yes, uh, it's going to be kind of fun though. Um, what we're doing actually is the hinge drop explanation. Kalen mentioned that in the invisible card video. If you haven't seen that yet, check it out or finish watching this video because you're going to use this. Okay, the hinge drop is a, and I will go over a couple of flourishes at the end, and I will give you a quick little performance of Mercury Aces. No, I will not teach you. Um, <laughs> the uh, hinge drop is something you do to cover up flipping the bottom card. You'll be talking to them, you want to direct their attention to your eyes and to your, um, you know, what you're saying. Uh, and at the same time, you want to make a quick little break like this, where the bottom card's kind of separate a little bit, and then you want your pinky over here or your ring finger or whatever is comfortable for you to just kind of go with your thumb right there and flip the card over into your hand and drop the deck on top of it. That way the bottom card is now face up and they were watching your face the entire time so they don't know what you did. There is another way to do that but I'll go over that in a different video see reverse. Um, that is the tutorial for that. The other thing I want to go over is called staircase. Staircase is really cool. This is what it looks like when it's done, zoom in on that. It's a nice little flourish, make it look real nice. Uh, the other thing is a simplified collateral cut for you guys who couldn't manage the collateral cut. Okay. The staircase is performed like this. You take the deck, flatten your hand, put your other hand over it like this, kind of like make it cross with your hands, and twist as you go over. The faster you do it, the cleaner it's going to look. I'll just use the other deck instead of trying to pick up those cards. Again, the quicker you do it, the faster it's going to go, and the quicker and the smoother it's going to look from the end, like that. <coughs> Still have a cold. Um, and to fix it, you just do the opposite of what you did. You put your hand on it and twist it back over, and then square up the cards. Uh, the simplified collateral cut, instead of starting off with a section of the deck in your hand, you're just going to go middle finger, sorry, uh, index finger, pulling a section off then your uh, middle finger either pulling down or your uh, index finger pulling up, separating another section off, grab the middle section with your thumb, move your ring, or sorry, your middle finger back over to the uh, bottom section and twist it into your hand, and then drop the cards. And that's about it for that. And real quick, before the battery on the camera dies, yes, we are going to get a new camera. So Yay! Nice one. Um, a performance, let me get these in the right order, it makes it nicer if you do it in a smooth order, um, of Mercury Aces. No, I will not teach you this, and even the members area, they're not going to get to see this. Sorry. Alright, there's different ways to flip a deck over, okay? You can do it with a lot of finesse, like a dealer would or something, or you can do it kind of like they do uh, in the casinos, kind of, you know, try to uh, hide everything, do it kind of behind the deck, you know, kind of cheating. But uh, I found that the best way to flip cards over is with a twist because it's completely inconspicuous. People don't uh, watch for it, and it works every time, right? In fact, with shake afterwards, you can flip a different card over. Uh, hold on, I don't want to repeat myself here. Flip over the Ace of Clubs. With another shake, a different card is face up. Now, continue shot here uh, real quick. Uh, the last card is always the Ace of Spades. It's always the hardest one to get because it's got the most elaborate design. Real quick, while I go over, uh, all the cards are face down. There, all four cards. Wrong. The Ace of Spades is face up. And that is Mercury Aces. It will be on the web store eventually. Check it out, and if you're not a member yet, sign up. Okay?